This is a breaking news alert. More late breaking news at this hour. Amazing video we're going to show you in a moment. Donald Trump spotted in Florida doing something unthinkable for the survivors of Hurricane Irma. Danny Gold, Liberty Writers reporting, giving us the background on this. The first thing this morning, President Trump did with his First Lady Melania and Vice President Pence. They hopped aboard Air Force One and went straight to Florida. Now, they were initially going to go and observe the damages, but that was not enough for our loving president. No, Donald Trump, he's a man of the people, and that's exactly where he went. Instead of going home, Trump actually headed to a shelter, and he did something amazing. He fed the masses. Take a look. Isn't that beautiful? Yes, President Trump spotted in Naples, Florida, handing out sandwiches and talking to those worst hit by the hurricane. He swore to the victims on the spot, we are there for you 100%, but that wasn't the only promise that Trump made in Florida today. He told the cameras around him how special Floridians are before promising he would be back again to help them out. He was in Naples, Fort Myers, uh, two areas that were devastated by uh, Hurricane Irma. Now, I have family in that part of the country, and uh, I was actually home, and I was recovering from my surgery over the weekend, and <clears throat> we were watching the devastation on the Weather Channel. Uh, and it was wild to watch the Weather Channel even get it wrong. I'm sitting here thinking as I'm watching the, the, the news come out of the Weather Channel, they're talking about 15-foot storm surges. And I'm going to myself, my goodness, you know, we have family there. What's going to happen? What's going to happen to their homes, our friends down there uh, in the Cape Coral and Fort Myers area? And uh, all of a sudden, they stopped talking about the storm surge. There was nothing there. There was no, no coverage of it. And I turned to my father. And I said, you know what? This is kind of like the election night. You know, they kept saying Hillary's going to win. Hillary's going to win. And then they were dead wrong again. The Weather Channel saying 7 to 15 foot storm, sur uh, storm surges from Hurricane Irma. Repeating it, creating so much mass hysteria that kept us glued to the television waiting to see what was going to happen. And then when there was no storm surge, we had to search to the local news to figure out exactly what happened because the Weather Channel stopped reporting it because they were dead freaking wrong. Turns out the storm surge in that area was only about a foot in some places in the Cape Coral uh, area. So, like, what happened? You know, Weather Channel hyping it up just like CNN hyping up Hillary's, Hillary's win, only to, you know, shut it down when nothing happened. Anyway, that's just a side note of how I was experiencing that whole, whole thing as it was unfolding. It was great to see Trump out there uh, in those stomping grounds that I have friends and family and, uh, you know, reassuring the folks that, you know, it's going to be better. He, he said, this is a state, he's like, I know very well, you understand these are special people, and we love them. He said, we love these people, and we're going to be back, and we're going to help them. So, amazing, amazing uh, footage today of Trump handing out sandwiches, of all things, with Melania and the vice president. Beautiful video. So, what are your thoughts? Comment below. Subscribe for updates. Did you watch the Weather Channel? Did you see any of that reporting? Did you, or did you, do you share my uh, observations? Leave your comments on that below, and I'll see you at the next report. For the next News Network, I'm Gary Franchi. Badass shirt now available. Link in the description. You possess the power to impact the global narrative. Please share this report, and to get more videos like this, become an X-News subscriber by clicking the link below. Thank you for watching, The Next News Network.